Hey everybody, today I have a haul for you guys of different stores and um, not just from one day, from like the week or so and just things that I bought that are clearance mostly and so I'm going to start with Joann's and a lot of the things I already took out of the packaging because as soon as I get home usually I put them where they go because my, my room is really small so I have to do that sort of thing so this are silver book plates and the regular price is $3.99 and I got them for 99 cents and that's how much comes in the pack and you can always um, color them with alcohol inks and sorts so I was really excited about that and for a dollar so I put these away other things that I got at Joann's and this is perfect for like mini albums or tags or probably anything but are these hem tapes, hemp tape type lace. Um, these, this has three yards in it and it was 50 cents. And I think it has to be more than probably like $1.99 regular price. And then here's another one. And the rest of them I had already taken out of the package because I store them in this thing and it's just easier to take them out of the little wrappings. But this one's really pretty. The color is like a lilac or something. And this lace, the, I just grabbed all the colors I could find. They didn't have any white, and I usually like the white because you can always color it whatever color you want. But these are the ones that I found, and they were 50 cents each. And they have either two yards and a half or three yards in there, so it's really good for 50 cents. And here's another one, and I'm planning on making... Um, lace flowers out of them too so this was a really good deal and I barely got them yesterday so you guys could go and check out your Joann's and see if you guys find you know anything similar another thing that I got and they're still on clearance too is a 50 pack of um, cards and envelopes and let me see it's white and it has the two it has the 50 envelopes in there and the regular price, I don't know, I think it was like $9.99 or something. I'm not sure. That's what it said on the little tag. But I um, I got them for $0.99. Cents, so it was really awesome. A really good deal. And even if it wasn't that much, it, must, it would have been at least $5. So that was also a really good deal. Also at Joann's, I found this um, scrap pack. And the regular price is $3.99 and I got it for $0.99. Cents. And it's really thick. It's a lot of paper in there. And it's perfect for card making or anything like that. And it's really handy and, and small. So I like it. I even just pull it up. Okay, and let me see. I'll just go to the paper pads later. I also went to Michael's and by their like dollar through five dollar section they have these recipe books let me see if i can lift up the camera a little bit see they say recipe and i believe they're by paula dean i think that's her name i don't know i had the wrapper somewhere around here but um they're five dollars regular but you can use your coupon on them and i got them not for recipes but um to store my stamps because like here I have all my recollection stamps and it's just easy because um, I get the little cheap protectors, the little ones and since the binder is little it just makes it more compact and I like it this way and I can just put it on my bookshelf and it's not really bulky so I just have you know one brand of stamps here and then oh and these ones here the last ones on my this one I got for one dollar and something. Well, all of these I got on clearance, but just recently this one I got for a dollar seventy something at Michael's. And I know there's another one in here somewhere, but I don't know where it's at. Anyway, so that, and then here's the other one. And see how these recipes are actually pretty cute. But if you don't like them, you can always cover them up. And this this stamp set here I got for. For five dollars which isn't really that great for me because I always buy things on clearance but I mean really good clearance and that's like the first markdown but I really liked it and it's been that way for like three months or so so I got impatient I just got it 
And I know I have another one here somewhere. Mm, let me see. No, I guess I don't. I don't know where I put the other one, but I had another one that I also got at Michael's. So those are good ideas for stamp, for storing your stamps and see how like easy they are to, to store anyway. And then also at Michael's, trying to put this stuff away, I got these little um, studs type deals um, from the dollar section, but they're on clearance, so I got them for 50 cents. Okay, and then here I have this um, Tim Holtz, and it's the tag on die cut, and I, I got it on Amazon. Mm, I don't remember how much it was, but it wasn't a lot. I think it was like $20, and it's really awesome because I don't have to buy the tags anymore, and I really, really love it, and then it comes with these little book plates that you can, you can like, color and distress and do whatever you want with them so I really liked it so I was just excited about that that's why I wanted to show you that one and then back to Michaels I got a bunch of stamps for 50 cents that are on clearance so um, some of them are circus theme I really love the zebra it's really cute and they actually stamp pretty pretty good I've already tried them all so they're all having cleaned them and then here's a Ferris wheel. Wheel. And I love how they look a little bit vintage. And an elephant. I love elephants, so I was really excited about this one. And a little um, hot air balloon. I love, love how this looks when you stamp it. Okay, and then the following ones, they were on the 50 cent section, and you know how they usually have them outside and it's on clearance, and like the whole section is 50 cents or so because they're the dollar section and they're on clearance, or sometimes they're 25 cents. Well, these were, there was a whole bunch of these out there, so the lady gave them to me for 50 cents, but they were ringing up a dollar, and I really like them. This one says Believe, Hope. Dream. And this one says Faith. Family. And of course, Love. So I was really excited about those. And let me try to put them away before I drop everything. Okay, and then now to the last things that I got. And these, they look, they'll look funky because I, um, I already cut up the cover because I, I've been cutting up all my paper pads, taking one design, one sheet out of each design in there, the designer paper, and cutting it into fourths and making um, six by six paper pads. And I have a video on that if you guys like to check that out. But I got this one and it's um, My Mind's Eye. And I got it at Ross, and see how I already took like a third of the papers out, because they have one, they have three just three papers of each design. So I took one of them out, and for every single design, and then I cut it into fourths and made a paper pad, which I'll show you real quick if I can find it. So this collection is called um, Wild Asparagus. And I take a fourth out of the cover too, that's why they look wonky. Um, and paste it on the front of the little one that I make. But it's the same thing on here, I just made it into 6x6. Six six. If you guys want to see that, I have a video on it on how to do that. And then I also, so this one I got at Ross. And I love the colors and I, I love the paper. And they're just I I don't lo I don't like all of them like there's some that I like I probably wouldn't be using that a lot but I love a lot of the designs in there so I decided to get it and it has I think like 180 sheets and it was eight dollars and forty nine cents so that's pretty good I mean it's not like the greatest I've ever gotten but that's good also at Ross I got this one here and it's called summer fun 
and it was two ninety nine at Ross, and it's really cute. It has like a lot of foil colors. Oh, I have it upside down because I took off the cover thing. It has a lot of foil papers in there, and then it also has um, just regular. This is pretty matte in there, but and the ones that aren't foiled are double sided paper, so you can use the other side too. And it only comes with 18, 18 sheets, but they're cute. They're cute designs. And then here's another one of the same. And I like this one a lot better, and I saw it after after I had bought the other one. So, otherwise I would have bought this one and not the other one. But, it's like a traveling type. It's called, if I can find the name of it. Huh, I don't think it tastes... It doesn't say the name on here. Maybe it's the part that I cut out. But here's the here's the paper. It's very like map, and it has all these post-it stamps. I love this one here and this one, and then the other ones. It does the same, double-sided. So that was two ninety-nine also. And then here at Joe, at Joe, I'm sorry, at Michael's, I got this K and Company um, Life's Journey. It's really awesome. I love this paper. And I also made a little 6x6 book out of it. That's why it has part of the cover missing. And I really, really like it. And I used my coupon on it, and the regular price is $9.99. So it probably was around $5. So that was also awesome. And then finally I have two that I got at Joann's on clearance and I also made a 6x6 out of these so that's why they look like they're not new but they are. As soon as I got home I made the 6x6 that's why. Um, this is the green stack and I love that it's 70% recycled paper. It had 48 sheets but they are really really heavy cardstock so I love 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 this stack. And it was $4. So, oh yeah, it opens on this side, I forget. But yeah, it's really cute. I love it. And it was only $4. So I think the regular price was $20. So that was really cool. And then the last one that I got is this metallic, the metallic stack. And it has, um, it has all these metallic colors in there. The green stack was by Die Cuts with a View, and this metallic set, let me see, here it is, is also by um, Die Cuts with a View, so it's called the metallic stack, and this is the cover that I took out for the little one that I made. So anyway, that's my haul. I hope I didn't bore you too much. I know I sound tired, I probably am, but, um, you know, go check out your Joann's Ross. Michaels and Amazon um, to see, well not Amazon, but Michaels, Johns and and Ross. Go check them out um, and see if they have these clearances going on at your local stores and if they do take advantage of them, they're really great, especially the lace and these stacks that cost me four dollars and um, you know the other stuff, the stamps that were 50 cents, go check it out and see if you can find some good deals and share them with us. Anyway, so I'll see you guys around. Thanks for watching. Okay, guys, I completely forgot to mention one of the best deals that I got at Michael's, and it's this acrylic clear um, gesso base, and the regular price is $13.99, and I got it for $2.99. And the sign actually said $4.99, but when they rung up, they rung up $2.99, so that was really cool, and that was a nice surprise. Um, and I kept on mentioning during the video that I used my coupons and my coupons. Um, a good tip for that is to go to michaels.com and um, they have the coupons on there. And if you side click and save the picture on your computer and then just um, save it as a picture. And then go back through your computer and print out, um, print them out like wallet size. You get nine per sheet and then you can just go back every day and, and use them. And then also what I do instead of... Um, 
if I go to Joanne's, I take them with me, and they take competitors' coupons, and so does, and Michael's takes Joanne's coupons, too, so if you have either or, you can go back and forth and use them up that way, and then usually I don't pay regular price for anything, so, and that's every week. They post them and try to get them before Thursday, because um, Thursday it changes for the next week, and then you have to wait until Sunday to go if you need something, so anyway, that's a really good tip, and sometimes when I overprint or I don't use them all, the last time that I go in there, I just hand them out to random people. Here you go, you want a coupon? <laughs> and usually they're happy about it. So anyway, if you guys want to try that out too. So I'll see you guys later.